In this video, we're going to show you how to pair your Cena 50S or 50R to your Honda Goldwing. You're going to pair your Cena headset to your Honda Goldwing using the mobile phone settings on the Cena headset. You do not want to pair your Cena headset to your phone. However, you can pair your smartphone to the Goldwing. It's important that your Cena headset is within Bluetooth range of the Goldwing. Within five feet should be fine. From the main menu, select the audio setting menu. Use the jog dial and the enter key to go down to Bluetooth setting and select that. I'm going to show rider headset pairing, but passenger headset pairing works the same way. Select the headset pairing menu. Now we're ready to put the Bluetooth headset into mobile phone pairing mode. On a Cena 50S, first turn on the headset by pressing the phone button and pressing down on the jog dial simultaneously. This will turn on the headset. You may see a few red flashes, but when you see the steady blue flashing about every two seconds, the unit is on and ready to be put into pairing mode. Press and hold down on the phone button as long as necessary until you see the red and blue flashing lights. This indicates that you're in mobile phone pairing mode. On the 50R, I like to start with the unit turned off. Simultaneously press the center button and the plus button Hello? at the same time and hold it until you see okay. the alternating blue and red flashing lights. This indicates that it's in mobile phone pairing mode. While your headset is in pairing mode, select the Inquiry menu item and press Enter. This will instruct the Goldwing audio system to begin looking for a Bluetooth headset to pair to. Now this is where headset pairing on a Goldwing gets a little bit tricky because when you see this dialog that says searching for headset, behind that dialog or that window you'll begin seeing items show up underneath. And as you can see on the screen, there's one down there called Cena 50S. Of course, if you have the 50R, that's what will show up down there. But once you see that underneath that dialog, go ahead and click the Abort button. And you do that by pressing the Enter key on the jog dial. Now use the jog dial to scroll down to Cena 50S and press the Enter key again. And it will instruct the Goldwing to pair to that headset. Once the device is successfully paired, you should see a headset icon in the upper left side of the screen with either a number 1 or a number 2. The number 1 indicates that it's the rider headset. A number 2 would indicate the passenger headset. Now you should be able to hear your selected audio source through your headset speakers. August in Charlotte, North Carolina, but state and local officials have the ability to limit the size of any large... I hope you found this video helpful. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to click that subscribe button down below.